Hi, this is Michael at uh, Homemaker's Bar at 13th and Walnut in Over the Rhine. Um, I'm going to make a cocktail, an original cocktail called Parallel Keys, uh, which is uh, kind of a riff on a bijou, which is a classic cocktail similar to a martini but more herbally. Um, this one's inspired by the Future Retrievals exhibit. Uh, this is for Art After Dark at home. Uh, it's an equal parts cocktail. So these four bottles, it's gonna be half ounce of each, or depending on how you're measuring it, if you're making more than one at a time, just however you measure it, just equal parts. So half ounce of Geneva. If you don't have Geneva at home, gin will be just totally fine as a replacement. Um, of Genepi, which you might have green chartreuse, uh, maybe use a little less if you're using that, um, just because it's going to be more potent. Um, half ounce of Maletti. You could use Chinar or, you know, any sort of like dark, thick Amaro, but you should also just get a bottle of Maletti because it's new to Ohio and delicious. Um, and then a half ounce of dry vermouth. Uh, I'm using lo-fi, it's like a Northern California vermouth. We carry it here at the bar, um, but that you can substitute with really any dry vermouth. It's gonna be fine in this. Um, stir it up. Uh, the version that we make at the bar has a uh, an acid solution that's meant to mimic Krug Champagne, uh, which is a champagne that does not undergo malolactic fermentation. Um, we also will have like a batched version of this cocktail bottled that you can just get to go. Um, so that will have the acid. I don't assume that anyone will have tartaric and malic acid just lying around at home. Um, so just add your favorite sparkling water and the get around for the acid solution at home is going to be just a squeeze of a lime wedge on top. And if you are interested in trying the original version could just do about one and a half two ounces of the batched uh, parallel keys ice and top the soda water and that is it it's a lot more refreshing than a bijou but just as complex. Um, thanks.